Hey guys, today we're gonna be doing a review of this Three Waters Kayak Big Fish 108. Now, the Big Fish 108 is a pedal drive kayak on the Three Water Lines. Three Water Lines is a sister company of Feel Free. We got a Dorado here, you see the back. And what they have right now in the market is, well, before this, they had super awesome paddling kayaks that were super stable, full of amazing fishing fishers, and amazing price the price was that was the selling point of course the price amazing price but you know they heard the market everybody wants a pedal drive kayak so they decided to come up with this big fish 108 which is a pedal driven kayak with this thing right here you got instant reverse you got forward speed you have hands-free fishing now we have taken this boat out on the water we flipped it we took it fishing we put it through the surf this thing is super stable but of course like anything it has pros and cons we're gonna start with the positive because you guys only watch the first half of the video so we're gonna tell you the good things first if you want to see the hear about the bad things watch the whole entire video all right guys so the first thing i want to talk to you guys about uh, my stupid phone is is like leave me alone i just threw my phone out because Man, it's done, never stop. I'm, I'm working here. All right, guys, so the first thing I want to talk to you guys about is the incredible, impressive design that this boat has to offer. The, from the second I saw it, I go, wow, I want one of this. It's just an amazing design, completely different. It, when you have one of these boats, you are one of a kind. You know what you have, and you know that, that not many people have it. It's just super impressive. Look at that amazing look it looks it just looks amazing super wide boat and a small and you have that look at this look at this i put the seat back up here because you could rest here you can stand up and rest let me let me get in there let me get in there you see this all this space that you have here look at this look at this amazing guys amazing look at all that space that you have wow <laughs> and, and actually we're not on the water of course but you could definitely walk like this like i'm walking now so it's crazy amazing design you have more so much space if you're a fly fishing guy you could just pull the seat back and do your stuff crazy stuff let me let me get out of here and try not to fall <laughs> oh i did it wow that, that's amazing the design just impressive design and um it, it just looks amazing right so that's one of the plus you get one of the kind of course a lot of people won't like the design and that's fine that's all you got ten thousand more kayaks right so let's go here and look at number two the second the second positive for this kayak is the unmatched stability this thing is super stable anybody well unless you're 700 pounds could get on this boat and stand up without any assist and fish and be like if you were on a dock not a floating dock a real dock this thing is super stable the stability is off the charge like you will not flip on this boat unless you really try to it's that stable unmatched stability we even had it on the surf guys and i put myself like this against the waves look at my hands are dirty and wave kept hitting me and it didn't flip me it didn't flip me i was like taunting the waves now i did flip once on that video you can check it out i'm gonna link it somewhere i'm gonna link entire playlist but it was because i was bringing the drive down and i didn't pay attention to the giant wave and anybody anybody would have flipped on that situation because if you're not paying attention i mean like if you have a car and you're going and you're not looking in front you're gonna hit something you know it's common sense right so unmatched stability amazing stuff now my third point here is price guess how much you get for the price of this boat you get amazing stability a lot of fishing fishers for less than eighteen hundred dollars amazing price eighteen hundred dollars and you get a kayak that is super stable and have hands-free fishing unmatched stability and it, it, it's just amazing I, i'm loving what feel free three waters are doing they're lowering prices on their kayaks making it more affordable for you, all you people to get a, pre, a amazing pedal drive kayak and go fishing super awesome stuff amazing price 
Now, let's go for number three. Something that you don't get on a lot of pedal driven kayaks. I mean, some of the hobbies have it, but it's not that cool. Well, well, you do have it on the hobbies on the Pro Angler and the Outback, but this right here allows you to put this seat in high position, in low position. You see here, the seat could go on these tracks or those tracks. It, you could take it all the way out and rest it here, or you could remove it completely. I used this boat with the seat on the super low position and I was still able to use the drive. It didn't, it looked awkward, but it didn't feel uncomfortable. So that's pretty awesome. Low and high sitting position or the ability of just completely removing the seat or putting it all the way back, that is a plus. And we are not built the same. Some people are huge, some people are small. So it's nice to have all those adjustment points on a kayak. And I'm sweating as hell, guys. Look at this. I'm sweating. The things that I do for you guys. Oh, by the way, we're in the middle of pandemic. Pandemic, is that how you say pandemic? Everything is closed. I wish I was on the water doing this review, but I can't, I can't get on the water guys. Number one, they don't want you on the water. And number two, my wife doesn't let me go. To... Yeah. All right, so let's go to point number three. We touch on point three briefly. And of course it is drive right here. See, I don't have the clearance to bring it down. So I won't be able to show you. Maybe I can show you some B-roll, but the great thing about this is that you have the ability to hands-free fish with this drive, which they did a lot of testing. It only has one year warranty, but they did a lot of testing and it's built like a tank. You could go forward and reverse, have your hands free to fight that fish. And that is a super plus. That is a plus guys. Like that is a plus guys. Not having your hands tied up with a paddle that you could actually focus on your fishing. That is amazing. It's super awesome, and if you haven't tried it, you should try it. And now with the this prices, dude, like eighteen hundred dollars for this kayak, seriously? Yeah. All right. So let's talk about the other plus that we have here, and it's that this thing feels like a boat. This feels like a little tiny bass boat. Like seriously, with this kayak on the water, if you're bass fishing or things like that, you don't have to. Like, it feels like you had a little boat, a little bass boat, like, but it is a kayak and you could launch it anywhere, pretty much anywhere. So that's a giant plus, it's, it's so stable. You got so much space here. Um, you can set up your fish finder inside. You have like raw storage. You have a giant tank well here in the back that you could put a nice decent sized cooler, the flush mount the raw holders with the retainers. Uh, this thing is loaded up with amazing stuff. It feels like a little bass boat and that's a plus in my book. You could even put your water here. This is the most important thing is that feel free through water skyx. They have an amazing team that really cares about their customers. I had an issue with my Dorado and they helped me fix it. No questions asked. Like I actually with my own money bought this boat, this Dorado and I had an issue and they responded. So dude like that's great like that you know that you spend eighteen hundred dollars on a boat and you have a problem and they're gonna stand behind it that is just pretty awesome stuff now now if you made it this far we're gonna talk about the negatives but i'm gonna throw you some positive with the negatives nothing is perfect nothing is perfect and i'm not here to bash on anybody i'm just gonna tell you like like it is i'm gonna tell you what's wrong with it what work what doesn't work and you make your own decision but i'm not gonna be here saying this thing sucks because it doesn't and if it sucked i probably wouldn't even review it because that's not my style like i said i'm not gonna bash on products heck no being such a huge boat also it's gonna give it the first negative which is a super heavy this thing is super heavy this is like 115 pounds just the boat itself not accounting for the drive this is like a super heavy boat what's the problem with that well if you have a car little car and you're gonna car top it i don't advise you to do that like if you're gonna use this boat you better have a trailer or a truck it's important yeah you could definitely find a way to car top it you could put it on top of your roof racks and maybe destroy it but hey look it's 115 pounds look at what it's rated for look at what your car is rated for and <laughs> act accordingly i remember i used to have a little full focus and i put a lot of weight on top with kayaks and i destroy the thing so you gotta be careful so you know that's the first native with the driving everything you're looking at 128 pounds if you have a bad back 
if you are not a heavy dude you may have issues transporting this boat now it's super compact so if you have a nice car like the malone car which i'm gonna link down below in the description it's gonna make it easy to transport it super awesome stuff but again this is a super heavy boat and you gotta see what you have what are you gonna use it to transport it and make sure that it's something that it works for you you know like anything this is not gonna work for everybody all right so number two is uh, well it's a huge wide boat it's not gonna be the fastest it's only 10 feet long and a half so it's not gonna be a super fast paddle it's not gonna be a super fast drive but you could easily cruise on this thing three miles to three and a half miles an hour no problem without killing yourself you could paddle it also i mean it's not the best thing to paddle but this design that it has right here with those giant cavities allows it to cut through water easier so yes it's slower because of the size because of the shape the design of the boat if you, the, the what i'm trying to say is that if you fish really far away four or five miles away don't get this get something that is faster because you're gonna kill yourself pretty much so yeah it's a slower boat by design all right guys so we have to address another negative and that is that the drive only has a one year warranty uh, comparing to Old Town or Native Watercraft, they have a five-year warranty on their drive. So definitely that's a, a super negative because this drive is new. Even though it's not a bad drive, it's, it may have issues down the road. You know, you, we don't know. That's why we have warranties. So it's, a, it's built like a tank. They test it out, but it's still one-year warranty. Now, at least, like, at least do three, maybe two, like the Hobies do two years. But one year is like the bare minimum. So that's a huge negative. It's not a deal breaker because again, this is $1,800. This boat with the drive is $1,800. That, that, that is an amazing price. And, uh, and again, it's built tough, but one year warranty, it's, it sucks. It sucks. One year warranty sucks, completely sucks. Maybe by the time you see this video, they increased it or, or maybe they didn't. But today when I'm making this video, it has a one year warranty. If it gets updated, I'm gonna let you guys know. Also, there's been a report that people were having issues with this rotor control, the able that it was breaking. So that's another negative that I hear. I haven't had any issues with it. Mine has never broken. The one that I have here on the Dorado didn't break either. So I, I, it, it depends. I mean, there's always problems with kayaks. So this is one of them. So the conclusion, should you buy this boat? I mean, uh, I think I've been like super clear that you should definitely buy it $1,800 for what you get here is just an amazing price it's a buy in my book again if you are not a big person if you have trouble transporting it if you have a tiny little car it may not be the boat for you if you go long distances don't buy it but if you do bass fishing and you have a lot of clearance to use to drive you know you're always fishing a little deep and maybe a foot deep or something like that it's gonna work for you it does it's gonna work for you it's an amazing price amazing stability loaded with fishing fishers a nice comfortable sea that you're able to have it in multiple positions this in my book is a buy as long as it's gonna work for you again you fish deeper water you don't go that far and you're able to transport it you have a truck you have a, a trailer Again, those things. So you gotta, you gotta, you gotta look at what kind of fishing you do, and see if it's something that is gonna work for you. So this big fish 108, I'm gonna have it linked down in the description. That's gonna be an affiliate link to Amazon or ACK. And when you buy it through those links, this channel does get a commission, and that commission is important because we need money to make videos. It's extremely important that we make money so we can continue to make these videos because they're not free time gas cameras internet gun dude there's some like i don't know if i'm still like i'm probably not even breaking even with all these videos 